Hello soldiers, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to discuss about Alma Better's Python for Data Science. First, self project that is decoding aliens. First, we will read the description, then we will move on with the problems. So let's get started. The SETI Institute is a not-for-profit research organization incorporated in 1984 whose mission is to explore, understand and explain the origin and nature of life in the universe and to apply the knowledge gained to inspire and guide present and future generations. It aims for discovery and for sharing knowledge as scientific ambassadors to the public, the press and the government. SETI received some signals from a far away galaxy on June 14, 2002. Well, these signals could have been from a possible alien civilization similar to what you could have seen in the movie Arrival. These signals indicated the existence of a secret language for sending messages across. Following are the observations made by the SETI team who discovered these signals. Aliens share a tuple each element of the tuple will be a string of alphabets. Scientists still don't know what is the content of the strings inside the tuple, but depending, depending upon the length of the string, the string translates into an alphabet. 0 means nothing, 1 means A, 2 means B, 3 means C, like that till 26 means Z. Space between the words of the message is represented by an empty string. A sample message received by SETI Adam E is denoted by the following tuple. So this is the tuple guys. As we can see, here is the explanation. A list of length of each element in the tuple is. So we, we are having a list of length of each element in this tuple so here the string length is 1 that's why we got 1 this string length is 4 that's why we got 4 like that we are having a list so upon replacing numbers with the corresponding alphabets and spaces we get Adam Eve as you can see so in problem 1 you are given such a tuple of strings what will be your approach to decode it describe your approach no code required just write the steps in the following steps so you just have to write the steps so i am not going to do this thing you just try yourself you just need to write the steps so you just have to write your approach yeah so what you are going to do after seeing this tuple so you can write like in the first step uh, I am going to find the length of each string in this tuple in the second step I am going to store them in the list in the third step I am going to replace them with the corresponding alphabets in the step 5 I am going to print that secret code like that you can write so you can just try it yourself now we are going to solve problem 2 create a dictionary where the key corresponds to the position of the alphabet consider space as the first alphabet and the value corresponding to the key will be the alphabet as you can see first I just created a variable called alphabets so they told create your dictionary below with the keys as position of the alphabet and the values of the key will be the alphabet itself so what i'm going to do i'm just going to create a variable called alphabets here i stored a string of alphabets so the first one will be an empty one for zero then these are first one a for 1 b for 2 like that till z here 
what I'm going to do I'm just going to convert this into a list so just type list of alphabets so here delimiter will be comma right so that's why split with this thing comma so we will get the list of this alphabets now what we are going to do I'm just going to create another list with the numbers so here what I'm using I'm using range function range of 27 will give me numbers from 0 to 26 so I'm just storing them in a list so that variable is numbers list and the alphabets list will be alphabets underscore list so I'm just going to convert them into a dictionary as you can see alphabet underscore dict equal to dict of zip numbers list comma alphabets list so this will convert them into a dictionary I'm just going to print that dictionary as you can see so in problem 3 suppose you are given a particular value from the dictionary write the code to extract the corresponding key from the dictionary for example if you are given the value h the corresponding key should be 8 so when we give value we should get the key so for that get your list of keys and print it out so first first step is to get the list of keys you just have to what you have to do I am just creating a new variable called new underscore alphabet underscore keys here list of alphabet underscore date so I am just going to take this variable dot keys so we will get the list of keys then so to print this thing just I am going to print new underscore alphabet underscore keys so you can just see this output so this is a keys we got get your list of values and print it out so same step but here you just need to replace keys with values so I'm going to print this thing also as you can see we got uh, keys then values now your code to extract the key for a given value h here we are using indexing so dot index of h then we'll get the value 8 that's correct right now we are seeing problem 4 scientists receive the following message code from the alien civilization so we got encrypted message so this is a tuple you have been asked to decode the following message so here you can see I just stored this thing I'm going to run this thing so first I'm going to find the length of this particular tuple so let's see so the length of this particular tuple is 11 so we have to follow these steps follow the steps from your solution to the problem one create an empty list first I just created an empty list string underscore length underscore list so this is a empty list append the length of the strings from your tuple one by one so what we have to do we have to find the length of each string in this tuple and we have to store that value in this particular empty list so for that purpose we are going to use append method 
what I'm going to do, I'm just going to take this empty list dot append then length of encrypted message zero. So I'm I'm using here indexing zero means the first string in this message in this tuple. So it will take this thing then it will find the length of this particular thing and it will add to this particular list then it will move on to the second one then it will find the length of this particular string then it then it will add to this list like that we are going to add all these things in this particular list so print the list of string lengths here you can see i'm just creating a new variable called ssl list of string underscore length underscore list why i'm doing this thing you can see so this is what we got so i'm just converted this thing list string underscore length underscore list into the list then i'm just printing this thing so you can see the output now i'm just printing this thing so we have to decode this thing right that's why i'm going to print alphabet underscore decode so here we have all these things 0 for means nothing 1 means a 2 means b like that we are having in this dictionary right so decrypted message equals to an empty string what i'm going to do decrypted message equal to dec decrypted message plus alphabet underscore dict of string underscore length underscore list of zero so what i'm going to do so this is particular list right this string underscore length underscore list so what i'm going to do so this particular element we are going to find so here you can see string underscore length underscore list of zero will get me the number nine so this nine we are going to find in this particular dictionary so nine means i so we will get this alphabet i and we will add that alphabet to this empty string like that we are going to do till tenth so total we are having 11 elements in this particular list right so that's why we are we did till tenth so because we are starting from zero that's why we did till tenth and then we are going to print this decrypted message as you can see i need help so if you get any doubt here so why we are using decrypted message equal to de decrypted message plus alphabet underscore dict we used here append why can't we use here if that is your doubt we can't use append for strings so that's why i am using this thing okay that's clear right so this is the output i need help problem 5 encrypt a message for the alien civilization which the scientist can send through the em signals scientists want to ask the aliens why so we have to encrypt this message for aliens so you 
already have the list of keys and the values for the alphabet dictionary find the keys for the above message so message is y so i stored in a message variable so this is a particular string right so i just created a new list called encoded underscore message this is a empty list what i'm going to do i'm just going to take this empty list dot append new alphabet new underscore alphabet underscore values dot index w so what i'm going to do here in the problem here new underscore alphabet underscore values here we used this thing to get the number where that particular alphabet is there right so we are going to use that same thing here also in this problem five so new underscore alphabet underscore values dot index of w then h then y so we are going to add that particular numbers into this particular list then we are going to print that encoded message as you can see problem six get the encrypted message using the final list obtained in the above problem where you will use only alphabet a so get the encrypted message using the final list obtained in the above message where you will use only alphabet a so what we are going to do get the individual strings for w h and y so these are the individual strings str underscore w equals to so as we learn we can multiply a string with a number but the output will be in this form so we'll get eight a basically a for 23 times if you multiply with eight we'll get eight times like that so we are going to do the same thing create a tuple using the strings you obtained so i'm just creating a tuple and just placing those values here as you can see then i'm printing encrypted message as you can see the output problem number seven aliens received the reply from the scientist they decoded the message and sent an encrypted message again due to some abrasions because of an existing very massive star one of the words of their message gets transformed into something gibberish unreadable they send the following message so this is the message i saw a some gibberish please help me soon scientists were baffled by the presence of such an indisparable word in the message sent by aliens suddenly they receive another signal from them which contains a gibberish word but this time the letters have been jumbled scientists need to sort the letters for this word in alphabetical order within it to get the actual transmitted word the encoded list of unknown word is jumbled word so we are having a list here as you can see so first step is store the list of jumbled words in a variable jumbled underscore word so i just showed in a list as you can see so i am going to print string underscore length underscore list so you can just uh, remove this thing we don't need right now string underscore length underscore list equals to this is an empty list so what i'm going to do append the length of each string in the list so i'm going to use append 
then I'm just going to find the length of each element in this particular list then I'm going to add it into a this empty list so we did the thing then we are printing this thing okay create another list to store corresponding characters so what we can do I'm just going to print this thing we got this value right 7 19 15 8 20 so we are using again a paint then alphabet underscore dict for 7 we are going to find the alphabet then we are going to store that in this empty list so we got this thing right so we just printed and we got this thing now we are just going to sort this thing so we are using sorted method so we got the sorted one g h o s t so we are going to what we are going to do we are going to add those elements in this particular list as you can see we are using this kind of stuff so sorted underscore car underscore list of zero plus like that we are adding so as you can see you print the correct word so correct word is ghost print the complete message i saw a ghost please help me soon this is a message as you can see so here just we are using formatted string that's it as you can see that's it for now meet you next tutorial or next video till then do subscribe to our youtube channel and make sure to hit that like button if you have any doubts please mention them in the comment section i will answer them till then bye bye